A good budget projector can help bring a big screen cinema experience to your own home without breaking the bank. However, with so many choices out there, it is not always easy to figure out which one is best for you. In this video, we're breaking down the top three budget projectors on the market this year based on price, features, picture quality, and situations they will be used in. So whether you're looking for the cheapest projector possible or the best bang for your buck, we'll have an option for you. So if you're interested in finding out which budget projector will be the best for you, stay tuned. As always, all the links to find the best prices on all the products mentioned in this video will be in the description below. So for the most up-to-date information along with updated prices, be sure to check out the description. The products mentioned in this video are in no exact order, so be sure to stay tuned till the end so you don't miss anything. Starting off, we have the MSC A100, our pick for the best value for dollar mini projector. If you're looking for a budget projector that delivers a balance between specs and features, yet is still wallet friendly, then at under $130, the MSC A100 mini projector is a great value for dollar option. For its price point, the MSC A100 delivers big. With its Bridge Lux Cobb LED light source, 3500 lumens, and a 3500 to 1 contrast ratio, the A100 has the ability to deliver a crisp, dynamic picture even when projected up to 200 inches. Simply put, in the most important aspect of a projector, video quality, compared to other projectors in the sub $300 price range, you'll find the MSC A100 beats out almost all the competitors and actually compares decently closely to a few projectors in the $400 to $500 price range. Where you'll lose out, the 5 watt speaker is a bit on the low side, but still functions at a decent level. However, you will probably want to plug in external speakers to get better sound for a true cinematic viewing experience. Although Netflix isn't built in on the home screen, it does support screen mirroring from your phone and Chromecasting, which is obviously a huge positive, allowing you to easily show everyone what you're seeing on your phone rather than having people huddle around. Made even more convenient at just 8 by 59 by 34 inches and weighing in just over 2.25 pounds, it's small and light enough to bring with you anywhere. It's not quite pocket size, more comparable to a large book in size, but is definitely an added bonus. With an abundance of features and quality build, the MSC A100 rivals higher-ended mini projectors. It's well-rounded, portable, and also extremely versatile to suit your needs. If you're someone looking to get the best deal and the highest value per dollar you spend, the MSC A100 will likely be the projector for you. Next up, we have the Optima HD143, our pick for the best overall budget projector. If you have a bit more cash to put down, for under $450, the Optima HD 143X is one of the least expensive true high-definition projectors available that is designed for home entertainment and is also a passable gaming projector. The Optima's native 1080p resolution provides a nice, sharp, and clear image. You will be truly impressed by the cinema mode, where everything looks pretty true to color and is comparable to many of the more expensive 4K UHD DLP projectors on the market today. The 4K UHD projectors will have a sharper image of course, but the HD 143X is still sharp enough to hold its own and is perfect for those who aren't looking to venture into 4K just yet. Some notable special features to mention are dynamic black for improved black level performance, 3D capability, and one of the most useful time-saving features of all, ISF calibration modes. This is fairly unusual for such a low price projector. The ISF calibration modes allow you to save your calibration settings for day and night so that you don't have to keep readjusting the various modes to achieve the best color for the projector. The Optima HD 143X is also a good gaming projector option. Not only does it have game mode as one of its color modes, but it also has a specific setting to lower the input lag and features a low input lag of 16 milliseconds. It's not fast enough for serious gamers, but solid for a projector, especially at this price range. The Optima HD 143X stands out as a top budget performer for its combination of contrast, three-dimensionality, minimal input lag for gaming, and solid 3D performance. If you're willing to put forth the extra investment over the MSC A100, you will without a question get better overall performance. For those looking for a true budget UHD projector that performs above its class, then you cannot go wrong with the HD 143X. Lastly, we have the Vonkyo Leisure 3, our pick for the best entry-level budget projector. If price is your main priority and you want to spend the least amount of money possible, then for under $90, the Vonkyo Leisure 3 is one of the cheapest entry-level projectors that you can find that still gives decent overall performance. For the price, surprisingly, the Vonkyo Leisure 3 gives a decent picture with good color and contrast, but it's not very bright, and in general, it is better suited for darker environments, like in a basement or a room with no windows. 
Now, assuming you will be using it in the dark, then you'll be impressed with the color you do get out of the Leisure 3, and it can throw an image as small as 32 inches or as large as 170. But do keep in mind that with the larger throw size, you will lose image quality. But at this price point, you cannot expect this projector to be able to compare to high-end models that are hundreds to thousands of dollars. The USB input is very useful. By using a low-profile 128GB USB stick, you can easily pack up the Vonkyo projector with about 30 movie files for outdoor viewing, which works great for backyard events or a family camping trip. For a budget projector, the fan on the Vonkyo runs extremely quiet. The speaker is located on the back, but it's very small and not very powerful. On the bright side, you can easily connect to external speakers for better sound quality. Overall, you will be hard-pressed to find a better mini projector at this price point, and a very popular option, mostly because it's so affordable. If you want a better quality projector with a brighter image, the MSC A100 is a better bang for your buck. It may be slightly more expensive, but it's 3500 lumens of brightness, 3500 to 1 higher contrast ratio, and 1920 by 1200 resolution does make a big difference. Alright guys, that's all for now. If you enjoyed this video, please go ahead and leave a like. If you're new to the channel and you like the video, consider subscribing. We do our best to keep you up to date with the best products on the market right now, so if you want to stay current regarding the best gear, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Be sure to check out the description for links to find the most up-to-date pricing on all the products mentioned in this video. Hope you all have a great day, and we'll see you back here soon for the next video.